strikes. And we'll start to add some combinations. We're going to bring somebody else on. We're going to bring Mark back on. And Rod, I'm going to have you step off. And Joel, I want you to step on. Go ahead and step over here, Mark. Go ahead and step out of the way. Joel's going to be here. Mark, go ahead and step out of the way. Step over here. Pressure point strikes. I've got to explain a few things as we begin. Pressure point strikes, we're going to overload the energy of our body. These two particular pressure point strikes, I'm looking to land on my opponent's neck. The first one we call the stomach, nine. Second one is triple warmer, 17. These are just simple terms for us to indicate numerically on the body where we're going to strike. We have over 800 points of the body. I only want to show you two. In the fight, if you have less to focus on, fewer options, you'd be more likely to use this. So looking at Joel's neck, first strike. First thing we have to understand is I'm going to create a notch on my hand. I'm going to make a fist, put my thumb down on the top finger, squeeze tight. Makes tight fist, great striking tool. Second, we're going to go back with that same speed striking scenario. Bottle in the hand or I'm covering the wrist. As I step in, using that same hip motion, same twisting motion, same circular motion as a slap strike, I'm going to step into my opponent and right before it hits the neck, close into that fist position, tap into the nerve. You can see with just a little tap there's a reaction. We're going to actually show you and demonstrate a live knockout uh, attempt here. I'm going to see if I can knock this big man out and we're going to go live. Okay? But we're going to wait a bit because once we do this it's going to take him a few moments to recuperate. Let's look at the triple warmer 17 first. I'm going to push him along. I can make this man go wherever I want. Watch his reaction. I'm going to take either two fingers or the thumb. Arch the thumb up. Insert just at the edge of the jaw. Watch his reaction. Doesn't like it. Okay. What I'll do with him, I'm going to actually take him to the ground. Okay. Joel's a big man, 250, 260 pounds. The nerves help control our body. Once we interrupt that nervous system, we tend to get, we can get people to collapse. The pressure point strikes overload the system so fast that it actually will shut itself down, and that's our goal. When we use pressure point strikes, our goal is to immediately knock somebody out and move on to our next opponent. It takes some expertise, but if we really look, it's simple to hit. I'm looking for this circular area right here on this muscle. Okay? If we can find the muscle, right there on the muscle, we're just going to tap into that resource of that energy. It doesn't like this. This is actually sending in some energy into that neck. It doesn't like it. Now let me demonstrate the, the, the punch or the strike slowly so we don't hurt him as he has the bottle or throws a strike. As I step in, same as the slap speed strike, going to use my nerve strike hand, thumb up, step in, strike in the nerve. We're going to speed it up just a touch. Still not going to try to knock him out, but I want you to see his reaction. Okay, a little bit of reaction. Now, we're going to have some people off stage ready because what I'm going to do is knock this man out. Okay? More than likely what's going to happen, he'll just drop to the ground. We're going to wake him up a little bit, and then I'll give you some precautions. Are you ready? ready. Okay, here we go. Okay, let's help him up. Excellent. He's shaking it off. While he's shaking this off, what we want to talk about is not a technique that we want to demonstrate with our friends at full speed. Not something we want to do to our loved ones. So, what we want to do with our loved ones is get the targeted area, warm it up with your thumb. If they express some discomfort, you'll know the area to strike. You okay? Yes, okay. Let's look at it one more time. Let's look at the area that we're going to strike. Stomach nerve number nine. It's a simple name for it. Looking for that pressure point. Using my triangular stance, stepping in into the middle, keeping hands up for protection, perhaps holding the bottle, stepping in with that circular motion right before it hits, close my hand and strike that nerve. He doesn't want to hit too many more times. He doesn't want to get knocked out again. Now you'll notice the knockout didn't last very long because I'm not hitting at full force. If I decide to hit this man at full force, it causes knockout for a length of time or it can cause death. So we need to be careful with the people that we love or care about. And I care about this guy. So we're going to be very careful. Again, triple warmer number 17, under the edge of the jaw, we're going to insert two fingers or the thumb, causing discomfort. We're pinned up against the wall. He's got me pinned, grabs a hold of me. Easy to take control of, okay? Easy to take control of. If I want to grab with my thumb, run it across the nerves, very uncomfortable. A little strike in the nerves, very uncomfortable. But we're using these pressure point strikes to knock our man out or to take him out of the scene. Two fingers, thumb, or striking hand.
Thanks for watching our video lessons here at TRS Direct. Hit the like button down below and consider subscribing to our channel here on YouTube. Hit the bell icon and we'll send you a notification when there's a new lesson available. Thanks again for watching.